Hello everybody and welcome to this scouting report. I'm Dan Hyank here with armchair analyst Matt Doyle and today we're previewing the Saturday evening match between the Vancouver Whitecaps and Colorado Rapids. Matt, what's the hook for this game? A chance to see a couple of throwback playmakers. Dylan Powers for Colorado, Pedro Morales, maybe my favorite newcomer this year for Vancouver. Yeah, we saw Pedro Morales early on uh, sitting behind a lone striker. Most recently against Houston, though, he was behind two strikers in what we considered a 4-1-3-2, pulling the strings there in the middle of the three. He's really been able to release players into the attack from all over the midfield so far. This yeah, season. he's been remarkable. His ability to put a, a long ball just on a dime is, I think, unparalleled at this point in MLS. We used the word Beckham-esque <laughs> in our player profile earlier this week. I honestly believe that. He, he hit some of the best passes you'll see. And Vancouver's built to take advantage of that. Both Kenny Miller and Darren Maddox love to run the channels. Yep. And their flank midfielders put in an honest effort as well on both sides of the ball. But what I really like about it, Dan, is that Everybody knows who's running the show. Nobody's trying to be a hero. Everybody's trying to just open up the game and create channels and create options for Morales. And so far, it's worked beautifully. Now, for Colorado, their offense has come from the penalty spot, and that's where our focus is for the trend tracker. They have scored five goals this year, all of them as a result of penalty kicks. Is this the time we finally see them score from the run of play, maybe? I, I mean, it could be. It's, it's always tough on the road. But what I will say is that Vancouver at home, they bring their back line up pretty high. And they don't have a lot of speed in that back line, especially in the center of defense. And that's actually where Colorado's best, when yeah. they're getting pressured. And then they could find those spaces in between. And Dylan Powers plays you over the top. And suddenly, you're one-on-one -on -one with the keeper. So I think there will be opportunities for Colorado. But I expect Vancouver to hold the ball for the vast majority of this one. All right, well, we'll find out how it unfolds Saturday evening. It kicks off at 6.30 p.m. Eastern Time. You can watch it on MLS Live. 